to the Amateur Smokehouse Kitchen. Today we are going to be doing some more meal prep and doing up some, um, yep, some chicken leg quarters today. I'm going to do something different with them though. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these leg quarters, get them rinsed off, and I'm going to put them into a bowl here. And I'm going to let them soak for a good while in a marinade. And then we're going to season them up and then smoke them. So the marinade I'm going to be using is a Tony Saturay's uh, injectable marinade. That's what we're going to use to soak these in. And we're going to go ahead and get that done right now. I'm going to get these in the bowl, get them covered in this marinade, and we're going to let them soak. All right. I've got it in the marinade there. I've got marinade poured over that. And uh, so what I'm going to do at this point, I'm going to just go ahead and take some saran wrap, wrap over the top of that. I'm going to leave this because the chicken's still cold enough. I'm going to leave it out on the counter. I'm going to cover it with some saran wrap and let it soak for a good bit. Okay, we have been letting these things soak for well over an hour. I'm going to go ahead and uncover them, lay them out on this pan right here, and I'm going to salt and pepper them a bit. And I'm going to go prep the smoker. So I'll be right back as soon as I'm done seasoning these up. All right, I've got these seasoned up and I know you can see a Bucky's brisket rub over here in the, off to the side there and one behind. So anyway, five of these I've seasoned up with salt and pepper on both sides. And then the other four, I did uh, just a little bit of salt and some pepper on the back side, And I did a little bit of Bucky's uh, brisket rub on there. My wife really loves that stuff and uh, on the chicken so i wouldn't really feel right y'all if i didn't put some of the uh, brisket rub on some of the chicken quarters for my wife so anyway right now i'm going to go out and i'm going to prep the smoker and let these rest and let the seasoning other seasonings that i just added on there start to permeate down into the meat and into the skin while i go prep the smoker and i'll be right back and we'll put these things in there About that smoke I just love. All right, so we've got them in the smoker and I'm gonna leave them in here for a good long smoke bath for probably about an hour at least. And then we'll crank the heat up to about 250 to 275 to get them going really good. And then we'll probably finish them out at around 300. So we'll just check back in on periodically, see how they're doing. Sorry folks, I forgot to take a peek earlier. We're gonna take a peek now and see how they're doing. We've let these babies uh, rest for a while. Now we're going to cut into them. Of course, I've got to put this down because I don't have a camera person. I'll put this down. I'm going to cut into one of them and we'll be right back. All right, just so you all know, that pink right there, that is the, surf, the surface meat. That is smoke ring. It is really tender. I didn't even have to cut it. It just was pulling apart. So anyway, I'm going to, I love the skin. The skin is my favorite part. Good. Mmm. That gum is good. Alright, I'm going to try this uh, business skin on this one. I can't help it. Son of a gun, that's good. All right, guys, well, we're gonna get out of here and get these bagged up and put away. Till we see you in the next video, God bless y'all and get your smoke on.